Sabaha everybody and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to talk about the Zero Lemon Power Delivery Desktop Charger. This is a four port charger for your desk that allows you to actually charge your laptop, your gaming console, let's say the Nintendo Switch, and two of your smartphones at the same time, while providing you over 75 watts worth of power to all of your devices. This is TK and I wanna say thank you very much for Zero Lemon for allowing me to check out the power delivery charger here, but let's not waste any time. Let me show you what makes it so special. The box itself is very simple. All you get in the box is the charger itself and the power cable that you need to use with it. Looking at the actual charger overall, it's one piece. There's nothing really to do much with it. Uh, you connect the cable in the back and then of course you connect this directly to your power source. Um, on the front is where we get some of the magic. Uh, we have two different ports, two USB-Cs and two USB type A's. Now the USB type A's are rated to be at 2.4 amps and they are blue. So they are fast charging, but they're not specifically made for, let's say a Huawei Supercharge or even the Warp Charger with a OnePlus. They will charge your device and they will give you the maximum possible of 2.4 amps per port. Now, as far as the top and bottom is where we get a little bit different. We have noticed right there, it says 60 watts on the top on the PD power delivery option. And we of course have 18 watts on the bottom. This one's compatible with let's say the uh, Nintendo Switch. And this one will be able to be strong enough to charge up even your MacBook Pro. And when plugged in, you'll notice that there is an LED light that does turn on even if you're not using any of the ports. So first thing, let's go ahead and connect the uh, USB type A. And again, this is rated to be at 2.4 amps. And I'm gonna go ahead and run two different devices connected to it. So I'm gonna connect the OnePlus 7 Pro right here. I'm gonna let it sit there and it does say charging and it won't say basically warp charger or anything again keep in mind this is a maximum of 2.4 amps now it is rating only at one amp right now mostly because the device is running at almost 100 percent let's go ahead and connect the oneplus 7 this is the other device that i have here and of course you'll notice right there that it starts jumping as this device is asking for more power again both of these devices running at the same time and they're going to stay charging so i'm going to go ahead and leave them here and now we need to kick it up and we'll go ahead and bring in the nintendo switch now for the nintendo switch all you need to do is connect it to the 18 watt charging uh, power delivery option that you have here on the bottom uh, you don't need to use the 60 watt because we're going to go ahead and leave that one open for our macbook pro and here we have the nintendo switch i'll go ahead and connect it in now it is off so hopefully we'll be able to see right there it does show charging so it definitely does accept it and it works with the nintendo switch uh, let's go ahead and leave this here and the nintendo switch by the way is turning on and then the last thing we're going to do here is connect basically the last option which is the 60 watt option and we'll go ahead and connect this to our macbook pro and here we have the macbook pro where we're using the same cable let's go ahead and connect it at the bottom right here charging at 39 percent and it'll keep charging basically it's running on the 60 watt charger so what we get here essentially is uh, the Nintendo Switch, two smartphones, as well as a MacBook Pro running on the same charger at the same time. And you notice right there, it didn't actually drop the percentage as far as power delivery directly into both of those smartphones. And I'm still connected on all for these devices. Definitely very nice and a very powerful, versatile charger from Zero Lemon. The design is very nice, it's very compact, easy to use, and you can still use it as a travel charger even though it's considered to be a desktop charger. And I think the classification there is mostly because of the wire that they include with it. It's a longer wire to be able to allow you to run it through the back of your desk and have it sit on your desk, let's say under the monitor, like something to set, set up that's sitting behind me. Uh, but keep in mind, it works very nicely and you're able to use it with your laptop, your gaming consoles, uh, your smartphones, your tablets. It'll charge everything you need it to charge and it has a lot of power to cover it. Uh, just keep in mind that if you're using it to basically use the power delivery, you need to use the USB-C to C cable, which is not included. The only thing that's included in the box is the power cable to power itself. So you need to provide your own cables for whatever accessory or laptop or device that you'd like to charge. Like and subscribe as usual, and make sure you share this with all your friends as this will help out the channel. Thank you very much for the support, and I'll see you guys in the next video.